basically it comes down to I want to give my my kids the opportunity to be able to live and work and have a family here because if, if we're not doing our part now 10 15 years from now that you know things may not be going so well so you got to keep moving it forward I'm, I'm currently sitting on the city board I've been in, I'm in my third term um, and, and and right now I'm actually the, the vice mayor of West Point. I'm currently running for the justice court judge here in, in Clay County. I mean, we have a vested interest in not only from a personal standpoint from our investment, but from where we live, um, where our, our families are at, as far as the community and how well the community does. We're all going to succeed together, we're going to all fail together. And so um, we've always taken the approach, don't sit on the sideline expecting someone else to do it. We, right. get, we get involved and we take part. Like he said, we have a vested interest in this community and we want it to continue to be prosperous and to continue to grow. We had placed a sign on the on the lot that said coming soon Captain D's West Point Mississippi and so people started seeing that and then of course rumors were getting out and wanting to know more details about it the anticipation was building to where when when the opening week finally got here it was it was pretty exciting well West Point residents are pouring into the new Captain D's there the big response is creating big sales in fact the restaurant set the company record for first week sales since the chain opened open in 1969 one customer tells us she's been six times and isn't surprised people keep returning it was the biggest thing since Walmart came to town yeah I, I mean, mean you, you can imagine when Walmart comes to a town how what it does to a to a to a small town you know we we were that big you know, when, our, when Captain D's came to, to West Point, it was people were comparing it to that. What up? Okay, we got to order up. Our, our working relationship's always been good and strong, but we get we get that from our our dad. I mean, dad was dad was adamant he was our backbone. that um. The families always stay close. Don't ever, don't ever get upset with each other. If you do, you you resolve it right then. And Dad, he was the the, the biggest driver in us doing this adventure here, that putting in the restaurant and doing you know doing this project. And and luckily he was with us for about eight weeks after we, after opened. we opened the store. Um, and so he got to enjoy it. He got to see the success. He was always you know he he kept telling us it's gonna make it. It's gonna make it. He was a big advocate of. It. He wanted us. To have something where he he knew that we would all stay together, he would you know that was one of the things he bragged on to other people about. He says he said I'm the most blessed man in 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 West Point. He said all three of my boys live right here with me. I talk to them every day. I get to tell them I love them every day, and uh, he wanted us to you know to keep that going. And he knew if we worked together, if we had this business, we would stay together. It satisfied his wishes, but it was also the right thing to do. You know, looking at like he said, looking at all the uh, the different options out there. You know, you you know you're saturated with hamburgers and pizzas and and that kind of stuff. And uh, we said, hey, what's what's a niche and what would what would we feel that would work well here in West Point? Our plans and to, to take what we've learned from this one to to move into our second location. We've signed on with the, to do three stores total. Um, we don't want to stop there. I don't want to stop there. We definitely don't want to stop there. That, was, up that was our sign up. We're we're building on the foundation that our dad gave us. So then then my son and my daughter and his son and his daughter will have something to build on after that, and we'll just keep this thing going. But yeah, you know, we're with the brand we've got and with the success they're having, um, along with what we're having, we don't see nothing but good things on the future. Yeah.